The White House on Sunday defended President Trump's remarks denouncing the violence in Charlottesville, VA, one day earlier, saying his condemnation includes white supremacists, KKK neo-Nazi and all extremist groups. The president said very strongly in his statement yesterday that he condemns all forms of violence, bigotry, and hatred. The White House said in a statement, of course that includes white supremacists, KKK neo-Nazi and all extremist groups, a spokesperson added. He called for national unity and bringing all Americans together. The official statement comes after Trump took bipartisan heat on Saturday for not directly calling out hate groups in his remarks, and for blaming many sides for the violence. We condemn in the strongest possible terms this egregious display of hatred, bigotry and violence on many sides, on many sides, Trump said at a press conference from his New Jersey golf course. It's been going on for a long time in our country. Not Donald Trump Donald John Trump Colbert questions Trump what's tougher than fire and fury Trump's D.C. hotel exceeds expectations making him so far in 2017 gram on North Korea if we have to, well go to war more. Not Barack Obama Barack Obama Biden endorses them in Alabama Senate primary rice U.S. has failed in denuclearization of North Korea Trump threatens McConnell more, this has been going on for a long, long time, he continued, before highlighting his administration's accomplishments. Three people died in Charlottesville during a white supremacist rally on Saturday, including one counter-protester and two police officers whose helicopter crashed, and dozens were left injured. This developing report will be updated.